Hey everybody, yo, welcome to today's reaction and analysis video. It's your boy Frank, your favorite vocal coach. And today we're gonna be doing yet another reaction and analysis video. Now this song came out a couple of days ago and it came out in the form of a movie. And now for the first time, I think, Dimash is gonna be performing this one live. I wonder how he's gonna do it because right now we're gonna listen to it without the full video, which is kind of lengthy but interesting. Okay, but anyway, let's go on.
Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. What can I say? This is the most insane performance I've ever seen of Dimash. Not just of anybody, but of Dimash. Now, this guy sank on all the range of my keyboard. I have my keyboard right here in front of me. He sang really low, he sang really high. He sang, he sang tones that I've never heard from him. Let's start with the really deep one, the bass voice. My goodness, I've never heard him reach that low. Just in this song alone, he perhaps must have used over four octaves. Wow, this is super incredible. And how about the distorted tone, like the kind of tone you get when, um, when you hear um, a hard rock singer sing, the growling and distortion and all that. How did he do this? Oh, what in the world is this? He makes it look so easy. What did I just watch, guys? What did we just watch? This is insane. Is this even real? I mean, talk about flexibility. You see it in this guy because he sang for 10 minutes and in the singing, he did all kind of crazy stuff with his vocals. And it still sounded so good at the end. That's agility. That's what I call flexibility. Wow. Wow. What a performance. The best. <laughs> I think I think this tops all the others before. This is the best Dimash performance I've ever seen. Incredible. Incredible. Wow. I got to go. <laughs> I just got to go. Man, what did I just watch? <laughs> wow. <laughs>